So one of the things that's really important for your dog to be able to understand is how to wear a muzzle and that it's nothing to fear. Um, even if you don't have an aggressive dog, teaching your dog to wear a muzzle is still really good because it, if they ever have to wear a muzzle, it's, it's a good thing, right? And that might have to happen at the veterinarian. My favorite are these basket muzzles by Basketville. Um, they're very easy to feed your dogs with them. Um, also, you're able to watch your dog's mouth body language much better, which is great if you do have a reactive dog. So the best way to start getting your dog used to the muzzle is just by having it around. Let them interact with it. Put some treats around it. Good girl. Good job. You can also feed them from it. So I'm gonna move the strap out of the way. And then I'm gonna put some food right inside of it like that. Okay. Good girl. Yeah, see the muzzle's a good thing. You can also see that Artemis is starting to stick her nose into the muzzle on her own. It's less stressful on the dog when they are able to do it on their own rather than you forcing it on them. Okay, Artemis, let's put it on you. So, what I am going to do is... That's my phone here. Sit. Good girl. Let's make sure you can, can see her. There you go. So the muzzle goes on like this with these straps here at the bottom. This strap here is where your collar will go through. I'm not going to worry about that right now. I just want to have her comfortable putting her nose in it. So I'm just going to hold it here, let her interact with it on her own. Yes. And I'm going to mark and treat and let her know that I like the interaction. I've done this a little bit with Artemis already, so she knows the, yes, the general deal, uh, drill. Um, so now I'm going to go ahead and proceed um, because I have done this with her before. So now I'm going to stick a treat here and ask her to put her nose in. Yes, good girl. And then we're, we're done. Yeah, very good girl. I'm going to do it again. Yes, good girl. All right, on and then off. Yes, good girl. This one's a little big for her size. Um, I actually got this for a different dog. Yes. But you can see now she's wanting to put her nose in it on her own. So if I just hold it out here again, yes. And then I can treat her through the bottom of it, all right? Now I'm gonna leave it on just a little bit longer and feed her a couple more treats. Like I said, this one's a little too big for her. <laughs> you can take your nose out of it now, silly. Um, and because it covers up her eyes. And this is a size four. So I would probably get her a size three. Yes, good girl. Then once they start to get really good at that, muzzle, good girl. You can begin to attach it around the head. All right. This strap goes over the top of the head and attaches to the strap you just put behind. Um, but as you can see, it's way too large for, for her size. That's a very good girl. My very, very good girl. Here, Cookie. Good job. Good job. And you can do this just for a short period of time. And I'm going to go ahead and take it off. Good job. Good job, baby.